guys. It's Ben on my way out to the NRL Grand Final right now. It's gonna be a long day. It's about quarter past 11. This day is gonna be long, but heading out there with- It's only quarter past, quarter past 10, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> that, that's, heading out there with me, cousin, cousin Jack. Hey. He's down here from Queensland, hence the reason he said quarter past 10. Going out with Jack, mate Pato. Yeah. There's Bardo. The on our way out. Hopefully, see, see Canberra get up in the main game. As long as it's a good game, it'll be good, but. Clive Churchill. Clive Churchill. Clive Churchill. Clive I've already done that in my prediction. Yeah, well, have you changed the prediction? No, I haven't changed my prediction. I'm still going Canberra 13 plus. I reckon 13 exactly. Have you got bet odds for that? Uh, I've got to put my bets on, yeah, but it, and I've got going to go Jack Whiten for the first try and Nickel Clodstack for the Clive Churchill. So we'll obviously see at the end of the night, end of this video, how right I was or how wrong I was. How wrong usually, isn't it? How wrong? I right, see. Are I the think sharks in the grand final this week. Unfortunately, I've got there. Unfortunately, sharks aren't, but. That's a reserve grade game. A few of our boys playing for Newtown against Burley. Not the Bears. So, hopefully Newtown can get that. As you would have seen, seen my, my vlog from last week out at the New South Wales Cup Grand Final. Newtown just got up over Wenny, but I'll probably put the put the link link in the description below so you can go and watch that one. But go watch that at the end of this. Get this, get out, get this video out of the way, and then go watch that. But we're on our way now, so I'll come back to you when we're out at the ground. Well, here we are out at the stadium now. So many Raiders fans. Definitely feels like it's potentially two to one, but the Raiders fans can get loud like they can do. It could be very intimidating. But he's hoping that they do get loud. Get, the, get Raiders over one. I want to see Raiders win it today. Hopefully Newtown can get up in reserve guys. Women's game. So I don't really have a team that I'm going for on that. Just hopefully that's a good game. But it's going to be a good day. Come back to you when we're inside this game. Yes. We're here inside the ground now. This is so much green in here. It's um fairly fair looks nice. It's uh, a bit of cloud cover rolling in but if it if the rain doesn't come, it should be a good quick game. But I don't know, it's one of those things. Wait wait and see, but as you can see, but as as you can see, like the field is just it looks amazing, so it's um, probably come back to you later in the day, later in this game, come back at full time in this game. So I'll just like what happens in this reserve great game, and then then we've got the girls after that. But I'll be back to you. What a game! Usually, excited for the fire. As I said, it was. Win-win for me. Like going for Newtown and liking the bit, liking the early as well. But I was so stoked Newtown got up. And what a way to win as well. Like the exact same thing last week. Like, I thought that was gone. To be honest, like, but it's, to get the win like that in the Grand the State Championship Grand Final, like, to win it, amazing. Now time for the Prezzo. Yeah, the blue bag. I don't want to say dragons with anything, but 
was like, I don't want to say Queensland, so I win it again. So, as long as the referees are alright, it'll be good. As long as, as long as it's just a good game, I think. If it's a good game, I'm happy. Don't want it to be too bad. I'm sorry, too dumb. I'm just looking at it. Game's well and surely over. Pretty, dis pretty disappointing. Like, open for a closer game, but Broncos has been too dominant. They were the same, they were the same last year as well. It's just, it's a real shame to see the grand final be so one, one sided. It's 30 0 now. Hopefully, the Dragons can go in here. But, yeah, nah. you reckon they're going in? Nah. So what? What do you reckon final score is going to be? Thirty nil now. With about nine minutes, nine and a half to go. Forty nil. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Dragon Grin. He's got, oh, he's awarded it. Dragon in. It's good. It's good. See, see that score. You don't want to see five. You don't want to see all right. See someone score in a grand final, but game's over. So. I'll come back here in the build up to first grade. Here we are, about 15 minutes to kick off. Place is back. So loud. So. I'll uh, post a separate video after this. But the stage here. That's the common fire up the public. Thank you. 
Yeah. There you go. I'll come back to you about 20 minutes later. There you go, Raiders are in. I'm spewing. Jack Lyon scored. I'm in first try scorer, but... Hopefully it's the start of something for Canberra. So hopefully Crow can slot this over. It's only there's only eight six, so Canberra's right in this. They're right in this, but see how it goes. There we are, it's half time. Eight six roosters. What a great game so far. I've really been things are either way. Refereeing is it makes things a bit dodgy. Refereeing could be a lot better, but whether the refs are feeling the pressure of the grand final, I don't know, but definitely, hopefully, it's leaving all the teams wide, but it's, it's anyone's game. Game from here on, might throw two points in there. Spewing, I didn't get my first bet up, had white first try, but can't win them, can't win them all, but it's. Everything seems to work their way back into it. Seem to have found their tempo and they keep going like they are. They've got a red hot crack at it. But definitely definitely getting good pressure on, but it's um, definitely a defensive game. But we had defensive ideas at the end. Whoever's got more in a tank could, could get a bit of a score on I think with how it's looking, but definitely the sort of game I wanted to say it's nice tight contested footy you don't it's a lot better than nothing against the girls game but that was such a one side contest that got boring like this a game like this it's not boring but so it's half time come back to you we about 20 minutes to go in the game you know it's, you know, it could be like the New South Wales Cup grand final last week and go, it's fine, but that's a bit of a long time at this point, but you never know. But I'll come back to you with 20 minutes to go in the second half. Just on, just over 20 minutes gone. Frogs just came back on from the sim bin. This is a really tight second half the way he wanted it. Um, both sides have given everything they got, but... Canberra seems to have been on a bit of a roll so far, but whether they can keep that going or not, that's another question. Um, hopefully they can keep up the momentum they've got, but we'll see how this plays out. Here we go, Rich the one at back to back. It's a shame for Canberra to get up, but what a game. A couple of dodgy calls, but Gotta roll the punches, I suppose. Ah. Uh, so, it's a great game. Then, ah. Uh, it's for the Raiders fans to have to, what's that? Can't say I know what it feels like, but when I was here, we won it, but, um, feels hard for an eh? Um, but if they can keep the same squad together next year, that'll be good. If they can keep the same squad next year, they'll have a little red hot crack at it. But I may have the presentation, but otherwise, you won't see me until I get home tonight or tomorrow morning. So, see you later. players after going down so controversially there's so many decisions just went the roosters way last night I feel like 
admittedly, I was wanting the Raiders to win last night, but just even then, without that, it's just that game to find the season. Focus on the referees. It's it's the grand final. It's after the game. We should be talking about about how great a game the grand final was, not what the referees did. And I've, I feel like that's taken the whole shine off of the whole grand final day. The kick started with a brilliant game between Newtown and Burley. Seeing Newtown go two weeks in a row, winning it with a kick in the, with like pretty much on the siren. It's got a feel for Burley after that. Tough way to lose that. Then you go into the Broncos Dragons in the NRL NRL Women's. It's I'm not gonna lie, I did get a little bit bored of that game because only because it was so one sided. It's I'd much rather see a grand final tight. Don't like those one sided grand finals. Because it just doesn't I, I don't know if it's just me or some of you feel the same way, you can let me know in the comments below. Whether if it's one sided grand final, it doesn't feel as big an occasion. Um but then onto the first grade. Like it's uh, yeah, the the it's just it's eating me up that that game is being remembered for the refereeing blunders. Because it was such a great game. Such a tough, tight game. And I know it was eating the Raiders, the players and staff and everyone involved with the Raiders up. Because, because through someone I know actually got into the Raiders post match function at the hotel. And they, you could see it in their eyes, you could see it in their face that they were heartbroken. It, it hurt them big time. And, and it's going to play in their minds for a little bit. But I think being such a young squad, that this is definitely the making of them. So I'll definitely look at them in the next two or three years winning a premiership. Because you look at the old adage of you have to lose one to win one, being such a young side, losing that could help them win. But I don't know. But we'll, we'll have to wait and see how that goes. So that's the end of my rugby league vlogs for this for this season. Um, thanks for, thanks for watching them. Coming up, there's a few. There's going to be a few more videos coming up at the end of this month as I'm doing my social media free month. Um, so I'm uploading this. I'm going to upload one more video, which is from the pyro incident in the pre-game show last night with what was it? who, what the band was. I can't remember who it was exact off the top of my head. Um, but there was a pyro incident. Um, so I'll post that video up later as well. But, well, as, as I always say, if you like what you see, give me a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, turn the bell on, keep keep up to date on what I upload, but most importantly, keep living a great life. Peace.